All right, it's December, my favorite time of the year, but not just only that, because this month is Juice World's birthday. In fact, at the time of this recording, today is Juice World's birthday. Now, I am aware this is the second video I posted about Juice World. Actually, I think this is the third, but this time we're doing something completely different. We're throwing all my favorite Juice World songs into one video, and yes, that means unreleased tracks as well. Before I start, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, because if you don't, if you don't, you're gonna get a whole lot of coal under the Christmas tree, and I try to warn you. So don't take it out on me, all right? Spread some Christmas spirit and subscribe. So let's not waste any more time and go over my favorite Juice World songs. I'm gonna start this off by talking about the first Juice World song I ever actually binged. That song being Robbery, which you probably all heard. Now, the first song that I actually heard was Lucid Dreams, but the first song that I sent and played, like, literally 24-7 was Robbery. Robbery was one of the first new rap songs that I actually listened to. At first, I absolutely hated any new music that came out. I really do just got very vivid memories of this song. I vividly remember listening to an hour-long version of this while moving out of my old house. You can say I'm being a little biased, since I have good memories with the song, but the song is still very well put together. I'm not gonna sit here and talk about it for like 30 minutes straight, it's, everyone heard it, but it's safe to say that song was an absolute banger. Now let's talk about his track, Legends. He would initially drop Legends for XXX, Tentacion, and Lil Peep, since both of which would tragically lose their lives. In the song, he said, what's the 27th club, but we're not making it past 21, and since his passing, it's kind of been controversial, since he would lose his life at 21 years old. If we're being honest, this was probably just a crazy coincidence, but every time I do hear that lyric, it punches like Mike Tyson on a bad hair day, which quite frankly, that's every day. Anyways, the song holds up all the way in 2023. If not, it only hits harder. So let's go ahead and move on to the next one. This next one is actually a G Herbo song, but Juice World is on it. We're talking about PTSD with Juice World, G Herbo, Chance the Rapper, and Lil Uzi Vert. Now, Juice and G Herbo completely carry the song, but don't get me wrong, it doesn't ever feel like a drag. I'm never waiting for the song to end, but the only parts I care for is Juice World and G Herbo, and I'd honestly like the song more if it was just them. Regardless, PTSD, I highly suggest. It's still one one of my top Juice World songs, which by the way, I'm gonna be saying that a lot in this video. But anyways, PTSD, thumbs up. The next song we're talking about is Glowed Up. Around five months ago, they ended up releasing this song officially, and it shows how many hits Juice World was actually putting together. There's so many tracks that I yet to hear and y'all yet to hear, which would actually physically knock our socks off. This dude probably got 20 years of music in his vault. But if you like Juice World, you're gonna love the song Glowed Up. It has that classic Juice World sound we all know and love. The last two songs we're gonna talk about are unreleased tracks, just so you know that it might be hard to find on Apple Music, so to say, or Spotify, stuff like that. His track 24 Hours is one I just recently found, and even though that's the case, I already like it a lot, and that's why I'm putting it on this list. It has more of the mainstream Juice World sound to it. By that, I mean it sounds less depressing and more like Lucid Dreams or Bandit, like more of a mainstream sound to it. It's one of those tracks you would assume has over 100 million views, but like I said, that is not the case, unfortunately at least, because this song is unreleased. But if you're a SoundCloud user like myself, you can find it, and if not, you can always stream it on YouTube. Now, the final song in this list is my favorite Juice World song to ever release, or I guess I should say to be leaked. Starstruck is an unreleased Juice World song that is absolutely amazing. The first time I listened to it, I got goosebumps. I was shocked when I figured out this song was unreleased. The song is so well put together, it is actually stunning that it isn't a full release. And I think it's safe to say it's the best Juice World song to ever come out. I want you to leave this video right now, listen to the song, and come back and tell me that I'm wrong. The song is genuinely a masterpiece, and I highly suggest it. It's a song that never fails to make me have goosebumps. And goosebumps equals good music. Hit the comments and let me know your three favorite Juice World songs. And since you made it this far in the video, hit the subscribe button and also turn on post notifications. All December, I'm gonna be dropping hella videos, so make sure to stay tapped in. It's still crazy to think that Juice World passed away, what, like five years ago now? And yet he is still carrying the rap game. Who would have thought? But I'm not gonna drag this video on anymore. I do hope y'all enjoyed this video. If y'all did, like, comment, subscribe, do all of that. Y'all stay safe, stay notorious, and peace out.